there is revised GCS which is frequently being asked in AIMS and this revised GCS was revised in 2014. We are going to discuss this revised GCS of 2014. So see this revised Glasgow Coma Scale which was revised in 2014. So there are three components. First, eye opening. First is eye opening. If it is spontaneous, what is the score? 4. If it is to speech, the score is 3. If it is to pressure, it is 2 and there is no opening. So none, 1. After that, second is verbal response verbal verbal response now see if patient appears oriented the score is 5 patient is confused in that 4 patient is speaking some words 3 producing some incomprehensible incomprehensible sounds 2 and none it's one third is best motor response and be careful it's the best parameter to predict the survival so it's the best predictor of outcome best predictor of outcome is best motor response here obeying commands Score is 6. Localizing pain. It's 5. Normal flexion or withdrawal of pain. Normal flexion or withdrawal of pain. 4. There is abnormal flexion. Abnormal flexion. It's 3. Extension. It's 2. And no response or none. It's one. So here you can see this is E, this is V, this is M. So E maximum is 4, V maximum is 5, M6. So what is the maximum GCS? It is the maximum score. It's 15. And what is the minimum score? E1, V1, M1. So minimum score. It's 3. Now see one hypothetical situation, similar questions were asked in AIMS. Imagine if a patient is having trauma and this trauma patient was brought to emergency. At the time of presentation, the patient was having spontaneous eye opening but patient was having tracheostomy. There was tracheostomy and patient was localizing the pain in left upper limb not able to move the right upper limb. So first spontaneous eye opening means score is 4. This patient is having tracheostomy. So what verbal response is? Non-testable. Verbal response is non-testable. And in right upper limb, patient is not able to move the limb. Might be because of fracture. But best motor response. So in left upper limb, since patient is localizing pain, it is 5. So what will be the score? You can see E4, VNT, M5. So the total score is 9. VNT. VNT means non-testable. Initially, it was said that for a non-testable parameter, additional score of 1 should be given and it should be added in the final score. Nowadays, it sh is not followed. So, we are not going to add an additional score of 1. So, if in exam, the options are 9, 10, 11, 12, what we have to mark? 9. And if it is 9 VNT. This one is better option. So these are the latest updates. There is certain other modifications. GCSP. What is GCSP? It is GCS minus P means pupil reactivity score. Pupil reactivity score. What is this pupil reactivity score? 
इट्स द नंबर ऑफ प्यूपिल्स नॉन रिएक्टिव टू लाइट मीन्स प्यूपिल्स नॉन रिएक्टिव टू लाइट इफ बोथ प्यूपिल्स आर नॉन रिएक्टिव टू लाइट द स्कोर इज टू इफ ओनली वन प्यूपिल स्कोर इज वन एंड इफ नॉन प्यूपिल इज नॉन रिएक्टिव टू लाइट इट इज जीरो सो इफ यू सी द प्यूपिलरी रिएक्टिविटी स्कोर मैक्सिमम इज टू एंड द मिनिमम इज जीरो सो इफ यू सी ग्लासको कोमा स्केल मैक्सिमम इज फिफ्टीन मिनिमम इज थ्री सो सी जी सी एस पी जी सी एस पी मैक्सिमम स्कोर विल बी फिफ्टीन माइनस जीरो फिफ्टीन एंड द मिनिमम स्कोर विल बी थ्री माइनस टू दैट्स वन सो हियर यू कैन सी दैट जी सी एस पी वेरीज फ्राम वन टू फिफ्टीन वेर एज जी सी एस वेरीज फ्राम थ्री टू फिफ्टीन दीज आर द पोटेंशियल क्वेश्चन नेक्स्ट इज जी सी एस पी ए सी टी वॉट आर द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ जी सी एस पी ए सी टी फर्स्ट ग्लासको कोमा स्केल पी प्यूपिल्स थर्ड ए मीन्स एज एंड फोर्थ सी टी सो दीज आर द फोर कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ जी सी एस पी ए सी टी दिस इज very very important and from last 2 years these kind of questions have frequently asked in aims